Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Milkeet Singh Academy. Today in this video, I'm going to share with you that how you can freeze, create group or split your Google Sheet into two parts using your Google Sheet mobile app. So if you are finding any difficulty in doing the, all these things, this video is for you because I'm going to explain different methods by which you can freeze or unfreeze your Google Sheet. So without wasting any time, let's start this video. So guys, first of all, you have to install this Google Sheet mobile app because if you are doing it on your mobile phone, you must have this application installed in your mobile phone. So I have already installed this because all these functionality works best if you have this application. So you can easily download this application from Play Store, App Store. So I'm clicking on it and after clicking on it as on the top right corner you can see this is my email so you have to sign in through your account if you haven't signed in and it will list out all the google sheet that you have access to or you have shared or you have created so this is the google sheet i'm clicking on it so wrap text because in the previous video i have explained that how you can wrap text in a sheet and this video is the next uh, part of the series how to freeze, create, group or split your Google Sheet into two parts. So let's first talk about how to freeze your Google Sheet. So here you can see uh, I have created a sheet with having a lot of information like first name, last name, joining date, occupation, department and all that. So I want to freeze the first column for say, I want to freeze the first name. So there are different methods. So the first method is here at the bottom you can see this is the second tab second sheet of my this google worksheet so here at the bottom you can see freeze slash group so this is the name so if i click on this button here so freeze slash group it will open all these options here and if i scroll a little bit down here you can see at the bottom freeze columns freeze rows so currently zero are set here by default if I click on this increase arrow at the right, it will increase the freeze column value. So if I click here, it will make one. And again, I'm going to click on the sheet. So as you can see, a, a bold kind of line has appeared. That means that this first column has been freezed. So now I can easily move the parts of my sheet into two. For example, I want to uh, see the salary of uh, these first name so i can easily saw that and same things applicable to the columns so i can easily freeze the columns so if i again click on this tab here and it will open up all these options so here you can see freeze rows so if i increase the value to one it will freeze my first row so first means first row so again i'm going to click here now you can see I can easily move up and down and again my this sheet has also I can uh, move here and there. So this is how you can freeze your sheet. So this is the uh, method number one. So again I'm going to unfreeze all that. So unfreezing is the same way. So click on the tab and just decrease the value to zero and it will unfreeze all these rows and columns. The next step is that you can freeze uh, like multiple columns for example I'm selecting the first column and here you can see a dot here blue kind of dot so if I select it and move it to the right now you have to uh, like a long press on the sheet so like uh, pressing your thumb a little bit longer and these options will open up here and you have to click on this three dotted button and it will open other options here you can see delete sort a to z and here you can see the freeze option so just click on this freeze option and it will freeze all the th three columns so first name last name and joining date so now i can easily move here and there and if i click on this ok button here and so it is like i have freeze so this, this is a second method by which you can freeze and same things uh, applicable to your uh, rows so let me select all these three columns so I, I'm going to unfreeze all these uh, that I have selected for freezing so 
so same thing applicable you have to long press then click on three dotted button and click on unfreeze so that is going to unfreeze all that and if you want to freeze the rows so i am selecting the first row and this by selecting this blue dotted button i can increase and decrease the number of rows so again to long press select this three dotted button and here you can see freeze so it will freeze the rows that i have selected here so similar similarly you can unfreeze that so click on unfreeze so it is unfreezing that so the next part is splitting your google sheet into two parts so here you can see that uh, <clears throat> total number of rows are 38 so if i divide my sheet into two parts so that is uh, like 90 so this is the where i want to split my sheet but i will split here from the first name so splitting is very easy either you can select all the rows that you want to split or you can go here into the tab click here and come here to the freeze rows so select and increase the value to like 19 so maybe more than 19 so 25 rows i have freeze the 25 rows so here you can see my sheet is now divided into two parts so you can see clearly this sheet is another sheet and this is another sheet so it might be very helpful for you if you are dealing with a lot of values in your sheet and you want to compare or you want to divide your sheet into two parts so coming to our last part that is grouping so easily you can again come here and decrease the value so i'm going to make it zero again so there's no shortcut for that so you have to do it manually so last is creating groups so creating groups is similar a lot similar to your group because if you are working with a lot of uh, like columns in your sheet so currently there are only eight to nine columns but if you have 19 or 18 columns and you want to make the grouping for example i want to make a group of first name and last name so you have to select the columns so i want to make a group of these two values first name and last name and again long press and click on three dotted button and here at the bottom you can see group a and b so it will create a group so it will like create a group you can see a minus button here you can like hide it if you click on this minus it will hide this group if you click on plus it will like uh, expand it automatically so so it will save you a lot of time of yours so if i click on this minus now let's create a another group here for this salary i want to create a group of salary promotion and experience so click on this three dotted button long press and click on this group g to i so it will create a group click on ok so here you can see we have created two groups so first is this one so here you can see at the uh, top of this uh, sheet here you can see the plus icon that means there has a like group that you can expand so this is the first group and this is my second group so these are like salary promotion and experience so you can also ungroup all these groups that you have created so you have to select the groups and long press click on three dotted button and you can uh, see this option ungroup a to c so this will ungroup them and similarly you can ungroup all these selected columns that you have selected here so click on ungroup and ungroup g2i so click on ok so this is how you can split your sheet into two parts how to freeze and unfreeze and creating groups and ungrouping all these columns so that is all for this video and i hope that you have liked this video and maybe it will somewhat helpful to you and if you like my channel you can subscribe to it thanks a lot for watching this video see you soon